better brother. Damn. What a great way to start off this day. I am wearing a hat when I just uh, had a haircut a couple days ago, but I had to go to the store to pick up some turkey and some new rice because I figured it would be almost gone at this point. And it is almost gone, so we're good. It is 12.30 in the afternoon on Friday the 15th, I think it is. Yes. Um, okay, so first of all, sorry for no video yesterday. It was kind of a weird day for me. Uh, it was kind of all over the place in my mind. But um, yeah, I hope you don't mind. I mean, you don't, need me. you don't need me every day, do you? I mean, come on, let's be honest. I'm not that cool, you know? <laughs> yet but um yeah we're just making our uh, our lunch for now and we had breakfast we had some cereal again some some car whoa oh zoom in god damn we had some good carbs with uh, the cornflakes with some milk we had the vitamin c pills we still have to take we don't have to take nine jasper jesus um and we're gonna have some fruits. In an hour, we're gonna pick up my sister from the train station, again, pick her up, and then after that, we're gonna straight to the gym, train some chest, shoulders, and triceps. Good day today. Then we have a call at six. All good, my man, all good. What am I doing? Okay. okay. What are cooking? Got a turkey, got everything ready to eat. Yeah, so that's it for now. I mean, uh, I just came back from outside, so that's why I look a little, a little red nose reindeer style. <laughs> um, I'll um, check in with you guys when we're gonna pick up my sister, I guess. Or if anything else cool happens, maybe on Twitter. You know, never know with banks, you know? <laughs> it's been uh, one hell of a ride on Twitter for the past couple days, so. I'm glad he's back though. I'm glad he's well rested and he's okay. I know, yeah. Check in with you guys in a little bit. Taxi service Jasper's back in the full effect. We have only 80%. Damn, I have to charge it after this. Please remind me. You cannot remind me, but still, it's kind of the way. Anyways, um, I had a banana. I'm um, hyped up, I'm amped up, because I'm picking up my sister. And um, I'm also picking up David. He texted me like, oh, I'm gonna be at the train station at 1.30. Uh, I'm gonna go to the gym at two. It's like, God damn, son. I'm gonna pick my sister up. At 1.32, so I'm gonna pick you up too. And we're outside now, and outside is a little nice car. This is, uh, Goals 2017. <laughs> that happened, but you never know. It's a beautiful car. Anyways, we're gonna go now. It's kind of funny because Monday I brought them, those two, to the train station as well, as you can see here. Okay, now you'll have to me. And that was funny, so now I'm gonna pick him up. I'm like a dad, to be honest, with you guys. And that's a, oh, such a nice car. I like it in white a lot. Anyways, let's go. So we picked up David and my little sister. I didn't charge my camera, I'm such an idiot. 15% left. God, I'm gonna quickly wrap this up, okay? I'll see you guys at the gym, enjoy. What's going on guys? Welcome back to a new workout commentary. Uh, I didn't do this over because my mom must keep calling my name, which um, kind of was annoying. Anyways, today I trained with David and did some chest and some triceps. Um, as you saw in the clips before, I picked him up from the train station along with my sister. And uh, it's been a long time since we had a good chest workout together, so it was good uh, to train together. Um, Dav David is a lot stronger than me, um, so that's always good to, to, to train with him. Um, we started off with some incline dumbbells because we both want to get stronger at that So that's why um, we started off with that instead of just doing bench or incline bench um, Yeah, so that's the reason um, I had the bench on the second notch like 45 degrees almost uh, which is great um, We kept the rep range very low um, five to seven repetitions um, because we both as I said want to get stronger so you have to have a little bit lower repetition rep range um, 
because you want to get a little bit heavier. Um, that's why, yeah. So um, was really happy with my sets. Was really happy with how uh, everything turned out, how it went. I did have a little bit of a shoulder pain at the beginning, but that faded away after uh, a couple of th- a couple sets. So it was good. Um, this is David doing his uh, last set, 36 kilos, um, which is almost, I think, um, 80 pounds or 85. I'm not sure uh, what the mat is exactly, but um, very clean, clean reps. And um, what I always tell you guys is um, have a spotter, guys. I mean, um, if you have someone who can help you with um, a heavy set, always use it. Always utilize people because um, it's just that little touch that I can give David uh, underneath his elbows. Um, he is able to do that set cleanly uh, and don't. He doesn't want to ruin his form. He doesn't want to injure himself. So uh, it's always good to um, to have that to have a spotter. And it's, this is one of my last sets, I think, too. It's 32 kilos, uh, which I was really happy with because um, yeah, I'm usually not that strong at this. So I'm I'm getting a lot stronger, which uh, is very nice. I think I got five repetitions on this set. I did. Oh, this is 30 kilos. I had 32 in, in another set. Um, I, th- I think in this set I had five clean reps, um, which I was really happy about. Um, really nice and controlled. Um, you don't want to swing the weights around, obviously. You want to really feel the chest, and, and that's the point of it. So, uh, as you can see, yeah, he had to help a little bit um, with the last reps. But it was great. It doesn't help too much, and that's the thing. It's just that little touch that can help you um, bring up um, the dumbbells for the one last final rep, which is great. And uh, then we went we over to um, bench and bench. We had to um, do a little bit lower weight because obviously we just had a little bit of a heavy set. So um, you can't, can't go all out on every single exercise in terms of your um, your goal, your goal and your PRs. So um, with this, we went a little bit uh, less heavy. Um, I mean, as heavy as we could, but still low rep range. Um, yeah, it was really good. As you can see, I'm... Uh, really learning to bench properly. Um, usually before this, I had my elbows tucked out a little bit more and I'm really learning to tuck them in and really um, contract my scapula and then make sure all the tension goes on the chest, which is great, um, which is everything you want, obviously. Uh, you want to train that chest. So this is an exercise I tried for the first time today. Um, cable flies, but then as you can see, my grip is its one of pr- pronated or supinated, I'm not sure. Um, which one it is, but it's um, like a neutral grip instead of having um, having it with handles. I tried this, and guys, let me tell you, this was one of the greatest exercises I've done in a long time. It felt really, really good. Um, you can really squeeze at the end. Um, the full range of motion, it, it feels great in the full range of motion, so it's awesome. You should definitely try this out. We kept this, uh, the rep range a little bit higher, so eight to 12. Uh, for the hypertrophy range, um, which was a great finisher for chest, and uh, I'm really happy how they, how this workout turned out. I didn't feel uh, film everything because we did another exercise, but we didn't film that. So um, yeah, but this is the last exercise I did. Uh, I think I did four or five sets of these because just because it felt really good. So if something feels good and you, and you feel it um, nice in the in the area you want to target, I definitely suggest you keep doing it. I mean, you don't have to do eight or ten sets, but I mean four or five sets is great. Um, as long as you don't ruin your form, as long as you do it well and, and you do it controlled and stuff, I mean, it's awesome. So, uh, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Um, I'm going to be doing an outro to this video now, and uh, thank you so much. Peace. What's going on, guys? Did you come back from the gym? I have a little bit of um, juice left in this thing, it's like a 3%, so I have to do it very, very quickly. I hope you enjoyed the gym footage. hope you enjoyed the commentary over it. Hope you enjoy my G Fuel shirt. You can use just pretend on G Fuel if you want to order your own G Fuel. Pretty good. Anyways, I'm gonna close off this vlog now. It's Friday. Make sure you have a good night. You have a good weekend. And I'll see you guys in tomorrow's video. Signing out.